San Diego beaches are being visited by a dangerous tourist lurking in the waters, the rare black jellyfish. 10 News first told you about the spike in jellyfish sightings off the San Diego coast just last week. And new tonight, 10 News reporter Janet Kwok explains why these rare sea creatures are causing an even bigger stir in the water long after they're dead. Janet. Well, Steve, here's why. It can break into little pieces when it crashes with the waves against the shore here, which can still sting even after the jellyfish is dead. At Mission Beach, there's about like hundreds. San Diego shores have turned into a highway for jellyfish. I got stung seven times. But surfers say they're seeing more of these rare black sea nettles lurking in the water that has them playing a game of dodgeball. Every 30 seconds, I'll see one just kind of floating by, and then I'll like freak out and go away. And Lifeguards tell 10 News they've seen a spike of black jellyfish these past few days, a sight they haven't seen in years. With warmer waters bringing them closer to shore, there have also been more videos of sightings posted onto YouTube and more encounters along the San Diego coast. Throughout the city beaches, from Ocean Beach up through La Jolla. Making for more dangerous waters. But once they get close to the shoreline and the waves pitch them in towards the beach, they start breaking up into thousands of pieces. That would make a mess out of a swimming area. So we hit Mission Beach in search of them. It wasn't hard to spot chunks tangled in mounds of kelp. Lifeguards say if you get stung by one, you should use a credit card to gently scrape off the stingers and then douse it with salt water. But parents like Richard Ranhell aren't taking any chances. Well, I've just been with my little man, and uh, we don't go too far out right now. It's so small. And back out here live, the lifespan of a jellyfish ranges from a few hours to a few months. So lifeguards say when they die off, so do the problems. Reporting live from Mission Beach, I'm Janet Kwok, 10 News.